What's going on, Super Auto Gamers? We're running a new weekly, so I'm actually going to take a look since we're going to still play on a hard mode. Uh, so I should be prepared. I see some fainters. Mm, I see a lot of fainters, actually. Are there any good faint, uh, fainty supportos? Uh, I don't know. We got the Blowfish, which is the only one that I'm using the new artwork for. I don't see that much, like, faint support. I don't know. Timmy got a Timmy got a 10 win on his first game on here on hard mode. So let's see if we can match him. I tend to fall into taking pill bug. Or, yeah, pill bugs too much. So I think we're just going to roll for stats here. And as good as another 2-3 is, an ant, I dare say, is like a little bit better. Ant is just like S tier, uh, tier 1 stuff. Let's be some overpowered mouths. You know what that mouth do? You can't even speak about what that mouth do because it's so overpowered. Um, I don't know. This is going to be an easy dub here off the rip. Um, I just watched the Oscars. Um, and, uh, oh, with Moth, we could do Run Pro Moth technology, but I think we could actually run, like, a mouse here. And then we could level the beetle, sell the mouse, give it a food, and whatever we get from the level up will actually be, like, good. I don't know if that's, like, crazy, but I'm, I'm putting the ant in the middle because I'd rather it give the buff to those guys. Um, but I watched the Oscars, no, no slap, but I think there were exactly five references to the slap, which, uh, was quite silly, if you ask me. I, I, I think there should either be zero references to the slap, or every joke should be referencing the slap. But that's just me. And I think a dice cup is super easy to get behind here. The only downfall is that we might miss out on a 2-1 buff from the ant, but that's like pretty minimal seeing the clownfish here i'm not happy i won't lie and if i get an elephant then that could actually ruin us with the dice cup but i think it's worth it for the stats i dare say so we'll sell the mouse we'll get the apple on you and we'll take a three seven i won't do two elephants because that's just a little crazy and we should sell the pig so let's get the clownfish Sell the pig, buy you, roll once. That's pretty good. That's going to get us a beefy elephant. And I know I said I didn't want to run two elephants. But I kind of want the stats out here. And maybe freeze an otter for a quick buy sell and a meat bone because it's pretty good. And we just hope our ant actually hits somebody and the elephant doesn't end up killing it, but whatever. Okay, well, we didn't get what we wanted, but that's pretty good. We got a 7-7 seven, seven to try to sweep. We're going to lose this one pretty hardcore. That's fine. One win, four HP is not the worst in the world. Let's get a big old God, statted elephant. And we're actually just going to go all in on statting up an elephant, which is kind of crazy, but whatever. I think we sell the ant now. It's kind of useless. That was not a great hit. I won't lie. Um, I'd rather... I'd just do a buy sell, but I don't think that's worth it. I'd rather get a good unit I'm not sure what a good unit looks like though mm, jellyfish kind of late I wish I had gotten you earlier maybe instead of the elephant but here we are let's just buff the elephant less units means less uh no it actually doesn't but that's fine a 914 surely cannot do too badly Unfortunately, he's going to decimate our squad while decimating their squad. We're still going to win. <laughs> Barely. The elephant almost called us, caused us to get a draw, but that's fine. That is fine. I'd take Dice Cup again. I'm totally fine rolling the dice. Let's, let's wait. 
So let's freeze you, unfreeze you, free no that's stupid. And that's stupid. Um freeze the snail, because we're gonna lose one eventually. And I'll take a giraffe for the scaling. You're gonna scale the clownfish now, which I don't want. So I look for a better tier three. Oh wait, you're gonna scale the giraffe. Which is fine. Do I really, ah, uh, do I care about getting a jellyfish out there? I don't. And I don't care about freezing a clownfish either. So I think we'll just roll. All right, now it's good we kept the jellyfish. Garlic. And I'm still not gonna commit to the clownfish. I'm sorry, but the baboon decided. He said giraffe gets the stats. Okay. I think the key to winning elephant at the back is great because he's gonna sweep. He's gonna do an Oscar sweep just like uh, everything everywhere all at once. And the point I keep trying to get to before I get distracted about the Oscars is that during the Oscars, um, a commercial played for a local uh, grocery store chain called Meyer. It's like, I guess it's not local, it's like Midwest, but I worked on that commercial. So that was like really cool to see. <laughs> uh, a squirrel giving us some discounted food is probably better than the clownfish at this point. And the stats are pretty non uh, bad. Okay, tier three. Buffing our buffers? I sleep. Still keeping the snail locked up. Um, but we gotta get something better than the beetle. And I think that will come... We can get rid of the beetle to get these snails out here to buff the rest of our squad. Uh, if we end up losing one, we're kind of on a little tear right now with our big, uh... Our big stats, and I'm just now realizing that I'm buffing the beetle, so maybe he stays a little bit longer? I don't know, at 11.16 at this stage is not enough. Yikes. But that's fine, because it's snail time, and my cat opened the door to my room, because he really wants some attention right now. Okay. That sucks, but we have to make it work, because the rest sucks way more. So let's croissant our giraffe, because he's got to stay. And I think the squirrel's actually going to go, unfortunately. And we just have to shred these snails, which really sucks. But... It doesn't go off?! This is so horrible. It's going to switch in like three turns, so I think I... Wow, that's so bad. Oh, that's so bad. And uh, dare I say, not quite functioning as intended, I, I would say. Because I did buy the unit. So therefore, I should get the benefit for buying it. Oh, that sucks. For you. Forgot I had garlic. Okay, a draw is fine, because we just need to stall to get Paper Shredder off of us. And at this point, I'm going... I, I think it's too late for the Falcon. I don't know how we save this squad. We're on Tier 4. We have no Tier 4s. We can't get no Tier 4s. That is at least an okay buff using the Paper Shredder for a turn. I'd rather get like other units, but I'm kind of grasping at straws here. They got a 1611, which is kind of scary, but we're still gonna do a semi-sweep. And we're actually gonna win this one, which is amazing since we're forcibly four squatted. Okay, we're done with the Paper Shredder. Thank God. Give me Dice Cup again. Dice Cup is no problem. And we won, so we can't, all right. The snails are done. I'm, I'm, I'm giving up. Give you chocolate. We need a tier five. You're not enough. You're enough. You're definitely enough. Because if you hit, if the elephant hits you, that's great. And now he's getting statted? Okay. 
already off to an 813. That's great. We get some garlic on him. Okay. Beaut one trigger is, is more than I really was expecting, so that's fine. And, and we're actually going to win, or we're going to draw another one. He didn't even get his fortune cookie hit. He just got, got good. Okay. This will be great when we don't have dice cup, and I think this is a perfect opportunity to get rid of the beetle. For the octopus. An octopus, and then we put like a pineapple on him would be sick. Okay, we didn't get it. I think I'd rather have garlic on you as opposed to a plus one plus one. Because you're getting mad stats right now. And I think we're kind of set with this squad for the rest of the game. Um, this is this is beautiful statage coming in. I think I think we got. Wow, we got pretty pretty lucky here with our shuffle. I won't lie, but again, stats don't lie. Halfway, five out of ten. I hate glasses, but paper shredder's fine because we're not summoning any units. We're like really okay with this. And pine, this is a dream. That was a dream turn with a dream like shop rotation. And we're buffing the octopus now, which is fine. Which is fine. We're in, in like as good as we can get for being on hard mode. On going into our first game of the weekly. Truly, I, I, I have not played at all. Holy crap. This is insane. Uh, he, he, he found the secret. He found the secret and it's elephant triceratops. Holy crap. This is awesome. I don't even think a potato is like useful for my squad here. Give me another triceratops. We're going sicko mode. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't even have words to describe how good this is now that we don't have dice cup. And we've got paper shredder, which is like non anything. Oh my gosh. Okay, that is an unfortunate coconut hit. Um. Oh, by one, by one, but that's fine. We got a stockpile of HP. I'm not worried. I am not. Oh, but rock bag actually is fine. 30 damage is horrible. I got to go rock bag, which is honestly not that bad. Put a little more HP on you. Get you close to a level. Feel a yeah. That's totally fine. This is this is getting somewhere. I really think we're it's getting scary because we're not scaling super fast and we're a little dependent on you know the triceratops doling out six sixes but he's doling out 12 12 stats every time the elephant attacks so I'm really not uh, concerned because <laughs> we got our elephant up to 50 attack holy crap Wow soft ice I'm like hard snoozing on I don't think garlic really needs to go on anyone else. I'll just double down on the giraffe. And chocolate. Awesome. I think I'd want to get the Triceratops to level 3 first, because plus 9 plus 9... Plus 18 plus 18 is going to be insane. Um, This is perfect, because it's killing the baboon, our lowest statted unit. Okay, maybe it's not that perfect because we took a major L, but this guy's got an insane scaling squad. Ooh, rock bag's fine. Rock bag is absolutely doable. I did not think I'd be getting the Triceratops to level three this run. Um, and we're definitely doing a lot better than I thought we would. So, yeah. The rock bag kills the baboon nine times out of 10. Which is fine, although I don't think it his tomato goes off, but whatever. Okay, it does this time. He turned into a 2019. This is actually so good. Beautiful. 
beautiful eight wins eight scary scary wins i think i gotta give the draft garlic now because he's getting enough stats for the most part and i'm kind of snoozing on another baboon if i'm being for real for real i'm mega snoozing lemon that is what we want is it the first lemon i've seen give me more lemon man i need lemon on all y'all all right, it's coming down to it. I'm pretty satisfied with eight wins so far, but if we could get more, holy new background. Okay, we got a 50-50 with garlic. This is this is wonderful. This is so good. It's it's totally over. You got a five five in the back. What are you a moron? Oh man. Oh no. Oh yes. That is so fine. Now give me more lemon. I'm rolling like a madman, but I need to see a lemon. Let me just roll for an entire shop and only get baboons. No octopus, no lemon, no giraffe. I'm sad, I'm a little sad about that. I mean, I can't complain too much because we got pretty lucky shops so far. Okay. We've lost, like, all our units, but they don't have much left. They, 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 they're, they're out of units. <laughs> it's, it's over. It's so over. Easy 10 win. Timmy, I'm matching your bet, bro. <laughs> Holy crap. I'm sending him a picture of this right now. I'm really, I'm really proud of this. First game on the weekly two. <laughs> oh man, he's he's not gonna be happy. He was already mad enough that I got a 10 win on hard mode before him on like my third try, but who just goes to show that, you know, however many stinking hours I have in this game are uh, paying off. Anyways, thanks for watching and I uh, hope you enjoyed. So feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye. Hey, thanks for watching, and make sure to like and subscribe to support our aspirations to become the two best trapeze artists in Tennessee.